Welcome back to another computer sluggish video. Have you subscribed to our YouTube channel yet? If not, be sure to click on the big red subscribe button and click on the bell to get notified when we upload a new video. In today's video, we will be taking a look at DX Diag, also known as DirectX Diagnostic Tool in Windows 10. To start off with, first you need to open up the start menu and you then need to type in DX Diag. You then need to click on this command here and you will then end up with a window that looks like this. And straight away, as you can see, there's lots of different information on this window. Basically, what this tool allows us to do is view all sorts of information about our system and the DirectX components and drivers we have installed on our PC. Like I just said, right here we have all this system information about our PC. As you can see here, we have what version BIOS I have. We also have my processor, what memory I have installed in my PC, and also the DirectX version that's installed on my PC. If we go ahead and click on the next tab, which is display, you can see a lot more information about my PC. We have what graphics card I have installed. We also have the DirectX features saying they are all enabled, which is good. And also in this box here, no problems were found, which is always good news. If you are having issues with DirectX not working properly, or you're just simply having graphical issues, then it's always worth booting up this tool and then just checking the notes to make sure there are no problems found. You can also click on save all information. You will then end up with a text document with all the information in it. Under drivers, as you can see, we have what driver version I have installed and we also have the driver model. There's lots more information there. If we go across to sound one, we've got more information and also in sound two, we have my real tech. Sound three doesn't really say a lot, but yet again, down the bottom here, no problems found, which is good. Let's go across to input. Under here, you will hopefully see my keyboard and mouse, which we can see in this section here. If we expand the USB devices, you can see all the USB devices that are connected to my machine. And that is basically it for DX Diag. Like I said, it's a fantastic tool and it's always worth taking a look at if you are having issues with DirectX. I hope this tutorial has helped. If it has, hit the like button below and subscribe for more computer sluggish tutorials.